A lot of people have surely been shocked last week by the assault of the Capitol by some of the Trump supporters. But surely even more people have laughed about the speeches, speeches that um, Jake Angelus made on television. Yeah! What I found interesting, uh, I didn't and didn't know about this person. Um, I'm, I never seen him. Um, uh, but what uh, he made me think about uh, in, when he, when he talked, because if you noticed, he talked always about uh, banking, especially, but economics in general. Uh, central banking especially, uh, technologies, technological innovations. So difficult stuff, stuff, subjects that you either study very well or you don't know anything about. Um, and so he used these topics that a lot of people can't, just can't understand. Let me tell you, uh, even if you study a lot, you can't know very well every topic, every subject. I mean, if you're lucky enough and if you're good enough, um, you can master one subject, but not ev all, everything he talks about. So he, what he uses is the ignorance of a lot of people that do not know and have this natural fear uh, that something bad is perpetrated against us. That That's a natural instinct that everyone might have. And surely a part of the people that uh, do not know anything because they've not studied, uh, whether it's their fault or it is not, uh, might believe to, the, to his theories. And these facts should lead to a reflection about a weak point uh, of democracy today. Because when decisions uh, were about simple things that almost everybody could understand, um, democracy was pretty easy to carry on. Well, it was pretty easy to carry on with that system. Uh, as, but today the system is in crisis. And one, there are many reasons, but one of the reasons is surely that when you make decisions about things that people uh, do not understand, there's a sort of disconnect uh, between public action and the, understand the, the comprehension that the public has about that action. And um, you might even have the problem that we surely have all around the world of politicians that don't know what what they're talking about, don't know what they're going to do, don't know what they're doing. Uh, but even if they know, there's a disconnection between them and uh, the people. There's just, they just can be trust. trust. So you, you, you mainly vote because you think that that person is a good person or you trust that party or you, you trust that religion or ideas or whatever. Uh, but, you know, trust is weaker than facts. And so, uh, whenever your trust is in crisis, the entire system uh, has problems.